Assalamu alaikum, Khalil Mohammed here with more of your Ramadan experiences. Mustafa Patel from Bradford in the UK has written to say, Ramadan has changed me in many ways, from being the guy whose mouth would spit out unlawful words to a guy who now teaches others about the deen. I started reading Fajr Salah. I now think about my every action and its punishment. Alhamdulillah, I'm a guy who needed to, to gain, but has lost many bad habits. Thank you very much, Mustafa. Eshrat Nasser Ahmed of the Momo Awards and the GNAA from Nottingham in the UK has said, Assalamu alaikum brother Khalil, I must say I have enjoyed listening to all of the messages you have received for the Ramadan experience. Me too. Ramadan once again has flown by, but did we attain the key objectives of Ramadan? Hmm. What areas of our personality, attitude, behavior, daily routines and lifestyle have we changed in order to bring us closer to the Islamic standard? The best approach is to pick one or two aspects of our personality where the change is needed and then devise a plan to make some defined improvements in those areas during Ramadan. If you have made the changes you plan to make, then this means you are a winner this Ramadan, and this month has been one of great triumph and blessings for you. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala assist us and bless us for taking us down the right path of our lives. Jazakallah. Thank you very much.